Hold on. Oh, hi everyone. I am Zanvi Pavar. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Or if you guys are new over here, then welcome to my YouTube channel. Let me switch to another light. Yeah. Wow. Okay, the lights. Good morning, everyone. Right now it's 5.30. I'm gonna walk you throughout my day and how I spend my day, a day in my life. So let's get this day started. I start my morning with meditation. I meditate for five to seven minutes in the morning. It just helps me get in a good mood and I feel like, you know, everything is peaceful, everything is calm. And I also say affirmations, like affirmations that get you in a really good mood. Like, you know, they just make you feel like everything is good. So I say affirmations like everything is perfect in my life. Everything is great. And I visualize, you know, my life as the most perfect, like perfect life ever. Cause I have that. Yeah, I'm gonna meditate now. And I think I'm gonna recommend this to everybody. I think everybody has different ways to cop up with a lot of things that are going on in their lives. And as for me, I found out meditation recently that worked best for me. So I think it's just, I'm still, you know, on the beginner and basic phase. So I'm still working on that, but let's see how I'm gonna do. sleep more I think five minutes won't hurt anybody so five minutes 18 minutes later disappointment I know but now I'm gonna actually stretch for a bit like I'm gonna stretch my body and everything so I'm gonna get up I'll stretch for around 20 minutes and then I'll get to studying so I'm gonna wake up right now I'm gonna stretch and then I'll study so yep currently it's like 5 52 so around 6 15 i'll start studying so uh in the morning i usually you know tend to just study at the study table because whenever i try to study on bed it's just super lazy for me so i'm gonna say the same thing for you guys because whenever you're planning to study in the morning make sure you're you have a study table you try to study on a proper table and so that you do not get lazy or you do not want to feel like sleeping again otherwise if you're on a bed and then you're studying you just feel like oh i'm gonna study after five or six minutes also my mother is awake now she gets up super early in the morning and she's outside in the kitchen and i'm gonna study so let me show you guys the study table and where i record my videos hold on okay so this place is a mess right now actually this is not my mess this is Sanvi's mess and for me you know i usually keep my books over here as you guys can see so these are my books i keep them over here like english we've got the manorma crime and punishment english literature and a lot of books behind that over here these are my notes and everything Oh yeah, let me tell you guys one thing. Whenever you're studying, like whenever you have a book with you, make sure to keep a pen with you. And when you're studying, keep, read it at a nice pace. So your eyes, they should move according to the pen or pencil. So if your pen is moving in this speed, so your eyes should move on the same speed. We actually do the opposite. You know, there is this problem with a lot of people is that, you know, if we're so fast, we don't have to worry about anything. If you have to worry about anything, you have to understand it for any reason, you have to start to explain it. Okay, so I'm going to hold on, let me check. Oh, God. So right now, it's 7.45 and I gotta get ready for college. I'm actually an assistant professor at a college, so I teach students. It's also well, bright outside now, so I gotta get ready. And uh, I'm an assistant professor at a college, so I go over there, I teach students. But right now, exams are going on, so I'm not gonna be teaching, but hopefully I find my students. So let's go.
And I am ready. I still have to comb my hair, but before that, I gotta pack my bag. I have to keep my laptop. I can get some work done. I charger of the laptop, charger of my phone, and my AirPods, a book. Packed. Yeah, this bag was actually gifted to me by NCPCR, National Commission Protection of Child Rights. Done. Let's go. <laughs> and we are off to college. And I've reached college. Ta da! This is the college. So I'm entering the college. Morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Yeah. Thank you. Let's go. Let's go inside. So now, obviously, I'm gonna take you guys to the staff room. Let's go, which is on second floor. Okay, so I've reached college and let me show you guys the staff room. Like, we have got tables and everything. I'm working, and so this is the staff room. This is where I stay. And behind me, we have Sonia, ma'am. Sonia, ma'am. Sonia, ma'am. Ma <laughs> she's an amazing teacher she teaches chemistry and right now i have to work so i'm gonna start working currently it's 9 40 a.m and i'm gonna work till like 12 and then i'll see you guys later and as i said it's non-teaching so i can get a lot of work done like i have to do i have to make some ppt some pdf some content for youtube and yeah so let's get this work started I can't balance this phone now. So I am very, very hungry and I'm gonna go down now. So let's go. I just met my students. Let me introduce you all to them. Hold on. Everyone, say hi. Hi. How are you all? Where is the CR of your class? <laughs> Hi, couple. Hi, ma'am. How are your exams going, everybody? English? Ka kaisa ga? I am a good teacher, aren't I? Here we have Sandeep sir. How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? Best of luck to your exams. Do you want to say something? This is my first vlog. Like it. Like it. All right. Thank you, everybody. And it's 12.48. I'm back in the staff room. Annu ma'am is here now. She's an amazing teacher, actually, and an amazing person, and an amazing neighbor as well. So I've got some work to do and I'm gonna see you guys in a bit. It's 1.30 and I'm leaving for home, so let's go. I need to stop in between, I gotta check to collect. So yeah. Thank you. Thank you. All right, let's go. Now, I'm in my car. I'm gonna drive. Don't worry, I have a license. And here we go. So let's go home. Uh, I just parked the car and I left my home. Now I'm leaving for a library, so I'm gonna see you guys over there. And now I am in library. Here is Noving Bio. This is where I'm gonna study. So I'll see you guys in a while. Maksha is here. I don't know. Do you guys see? I'm back home. Let's go upstairs, find my mother. 
father's helmet. Here is Anna. Whoa. Okay. And here is my mother. Take off my shoes for this. I'm gonna be sorry I'm doing this. What is Hello, Hello. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Hey guys, so it's 6 30 p.m. and look what I received. My mother gave me this. So it says International Book of Records record holder. So I am a record holder of being the youngest Indian to cross class 12th from CBSC, which is Central Board of Secondary Education. My father is here. Let's go. Hello. Hello. Who is Hello, Hello. Hello. <laughs> vlog. Hello, vlog. Hello, hello, vlog. Hello. Let me show you guys the certificate. Here we come inside. My father is opening the certificate up. Be the world record of youngest girl to class, class 12th was achieved by Janvi on 4th July 2017 from Samalka, Haryana, India. And here is my father. So, I came home at 6.15 and right now it's 7 p.m. And I have a class at 7.20. So, I'm going to have my dinner right now. And after that, in 15 minutes, I'm going to take a class of students who want to improve their English. Let's go. Class is over. It's currently 8.15 and we had a 55 minutes class today. Now I'm gonna do some other works and I'm gonna tell you guys later on what am I gonna do. So I'm on a call with my chacha. Let me show you guys. Here is my chachu. Hi chachu. Uh, hi. Say hi to my subscribers. This is my first vlog. Hi everybody. <laughs> He's my cha-cha. He's always been very supportive, you know, whenever I gotta make some rebellious decisions or bad decisions. So I can always ask him or I can always count on him. So that's what he's here for. It's currently 9.20 and I changed into other clothes. Here is my sister, Sanvi. She is packing her bag for her school. How are you? <laughs> What's up? Bye. She has got an attitude. 9.30 p.m. Now, I still have some work to do. So, I'm gonna finish that work. I just put Sanvi to bed because she has to wake up early. Even I have to wake up early. But Sanvi has to wake up early to go to her school. And I have to wake up early to go to my college. So, I'm just switching on my laptop once again and then i'll do my work if you can hear songs in the background then sanvi is playing alexa and it's 11 pm i did my work and i'm so sleepy right now but before going to bed i'm actually gonna journal I do that every single day like I really try to put everything that is that is going on in my mind and that went on in my mind the whole day I try to write it down and I try to put my thoughts on one page or two so I do that every single day and I also then you know write it in a very positive way because I think when you sleep with a positive mindset you wake up better and you have a better sleep so I'm gonna recommend you guys is that before going to bed make sure to keep your mind totally op open and you know and do not go to bed with stress and pressure so that you can wake up better the next morning Another thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to meditate for five minutes. I'm going to sit, going to breathe, exhale, meditate. That just really helps me get a peaceful sleep. And I love today. I loved vlogging the day. This was my first ever. So thank you so much, guys, for supporting. I hope to keep on making these maybe like 
once every two weeks i don't know but no i love today i love recording my day so thank you guys see you all in the next video stay safe bye